Hi boys and girls, the read aloud that I have for you today is called The Perfect Picnic by Sierra Flood. The Perfect Picnic by Sierra Flood. Squirrel and Mole were the best of friends. See mole right here and squirrel up over here. Mole's house is under the ground, squirrel's house is in the tree. They did everything together. They danced together, they baked cakes together, they went on bike rides together, and they especially liked to paint pictures together. One day, Squirrel and Mole decided to have a picnic. Squirrel wanted it to be the most perfect picnic ever. No butter on the sandwiches, said Squirrel. Right you are, Squirrel, said Mole, even though he loved butter on his sandwiches. After much preparing, everything was ready to go into the picnic bag. And off they went. Don't worry, Mole, said Squirrel. I'm going to find us the perfect place for our picnic. Right you are, said Mole. Rip. Uh-oh. What's happening to the picnic bag? This is a very pretty meadow, said Mole. Yes, but it's not perfect, said Squirrel. We need more shade. Right you are, said Mole. This field has shade, said Mole. Yes, but there's too much of it, said Squirrel. Right you are, said Mole. There's the cake that dropped out. Well, how about here, asked Mole. It's far too busy, said Squirrel. Right you are, said Mole. Something else dropped out. There's nobody else up here, said Mole. Yes, but it's much too windy, said Squirrel. Right you are, sighed Mole. The two friends went to a lot of places. You can see all the plates and the forks coming out of the picnic bag. A river, too wet. A cave, too dark. A beach, too sandy until Squirrel finally stopped. I found it, Mole, she said, the perfect place to have our picnic. And if you look back, you can see apples falling out, the blanket, the sandwiches. But Squirrel, we're, we've already been here, groaned Mole. Just then, Mole noticed something. Uh-oh, he said. No, wailed Squirrel. This is the worst picnic ever. Ahem, said a small voice. I believe this is your cake, said Mouse. And these are your apples, said Otter. I found your rug, said Bat. I have your sandwiches, said Seagull. And we have your crackers, said the Pigeon. Here are your plates, said Goat. And if anyone is looking for a nice cup, and is anyone looking for a nice cup of tea? Asked Hare. The apples were bruised, the cake was squished, the plates were chipped, the forks and spoons were bent, the rug was dusty, the sandwiches were sandy, the tea was cold, and the crackers were very much eaten. Don't worry, Squirrel, said Mole. We can fix this. It was not the perfect picnic that Squirrel had planned, but it was a lot of fun. I'm already 
already looking forward to our next picnic, said Squirrel. Me too, said Mole, but next time, let's have butter on our sandwiches. Right you are, Mole, said Squirrel. Right you are. And there's some different sandwiches with everyone's names. Mole, seagull, otter, hare, squirrel, goat, pigeons, bat, mouse. The end.